So what we're talking about is mm -hmm. my favorite thing ever. We're talking about iconography. It's the tiny visuals that help get information across without having to be wordy. So this is a florist company that we're gonna design our icons for today. This is their table of contents right now and it's sad. And so we're gonna make it a little bit better. There's something called visual balance. You are aware of it even if you don't know what it's called. It's basically the idea that it doesn't matter if things are the same size, they need to look the same size. So like if you can see here, we have like a square and a circle and they look, you know, similar in size, but when you oh. actually draw the lines, they're actually the circle's actually bigger. This is the circle and the square that are the same size, and you can see that the square looks so much bigger. These are the prompts we're gonna work for. So step one is we're gonna just start designing our first icon. It's about soil types, so obviously maybe dirt. For the dirt, I'm thinking obviously we're gonna try to use basic shapes to create these. So I started with just a circle, and we can always adjust. And I'm going to scale this down by about 30%. I'm gonna make these all the same width just so it helps my brain a little bit, but I just locked this in place with command two. Fun fact. I'm just gonna bring these over here. Oh, I see where you're going with it. Copy and paste these. If we wanna edit this, we can without it being destructive. I'm gonna select all of these and I'm gonna come over here. So I'm just gonna combine all these shapes with the Pathfinder tool. Direct select those points, connect them at the bottom. I'm gonna come in here with just an oval. I'm gonna do shift C, anchor point tool. And this turns points into harsher points rather than curved points. I want this to come in a little bit. Oh, Two little leaves, you see where we're going with yeah. this? So mm -hmm. I think we're gonna shrink this down a little bit and we're gonna make our dirt more of the main focus since this is about soil. We're gonna bring this up. What we're gonna do is actually just create a rectangle and see what this does for us. We're gonna come to flowers. Okay, so we're gonna try this. Mm -hmm. Transform, rotate 90 degrees. Select all of these, transform, rotate 45 degrees. Same thing, we're gonna select all of these and we're gonna make Pathfinder tool. Delete the center and now we need to add a center in our flower. I think it's really, really important with icons to kind of step back from what you're doing because mm -hmm. you have to imagine these will probably be like this size on a page, they need to be readable from far away. So we're gonna steal this same shape that we used over here with the leaves. So we're just gonna come in here and start doing some adjusting. We're just going to shrink our leaves a little bit. Something I love is you can actually directly copy and paste into Adobe Express. So we have our little icon already there. Look at her! Yeah. <laughs> For water, come in with the polygon tool, do three points to create a triangle. So I'm basically just gonna make this tangent to this line. Pathfinder, combine them. We can scoot this guy over. Maybe we just play with scale just a little bit. We're gonna come draw a couple points. Erasing that line. I do think that's a little bit better. Two ways of getting these into Adobe Express. You can directly copy them, like I was mentioning, or you can select them and drag them in to what's called libraries. Just drag them into the libraries and they will show up there. Oh. So then when I go to Adobe Express, it'll show up. <gasps> I wanted to show you guys something really cool. Generative recolor. So what I did is I just filled random blocks with different shades that I'm after. I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna go to edit, edit colors and generative recolor and then we can give it a prompt. We could do like Valentine's Day. I feel like this actually really matches with kind of what we were going for. I'm gonna outline these strokes, object, path, outline stroke and I'm gonna recolor these with our icons. Kind of yeah. fun. It's kind of all coming Good together. Job. I think it looks wonderful. Icons can fix all of your design problems. I'm convinced. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll see you next time. Awesome, yeah. see you soon. Bye everybody. Bye.